Hi everyone! In this short video, we'll show you how to use a Substance artwork effect from the Substance 3D Asset Store directly into vStitcher. Let's start by applying this artwork on the garment. Now let's go back to the Substance 3D Asset Store search for a new artwork effect. For this example, let's choose this nice high shine gloss print to add even more realism to my garment. Let's download this effect as an SBSAR file and return to vStitcher. Next, in the context menu, let's click on the artwork material properties and switch the material mode from PBR to Substance. Open up the Substance effects list and click on Import Substance to import the effect we just downloaded. As you can see, the artwork is displayed as text as it's using its default substance template for the mask input selection, which is text. Since the artwork we're using is a PNG file with alpha, let's switch the mask selection to color input alpha. Now we can see the shape of the artwork. To show artwork's colors, in the context menu, change the color selection from uniform color to custom color. Now we can see how the effect apply on the artwork's colors. The SBSAR file is a parametric file that allows us to edit different parameters. For example, we can reduce the roughness, change the fold intensity, and reduce the fold density to match with the t-shirt design. There you have it, a quick and easy way to add a shine effect from the Substance 3D Acid Store to your vStitcher garment. To learn more about utilizing Substance artwork effects in vStitcher, visit help.browseware.com.